the next question let a is equals to theta belongs to minus pi by 2 comma pi such that 3 plus 2i sin theta divided by 1 minus 2i sin theta is purely imaginary then the sum of the elements in a is option a 3 pi by 4 option b 5 pi by 6 option c pi and option d 2 pi by 3 first we need to write the given what is the given given is 3 plus 2i sin theta divided by 1 minus 2i sin theta that is a now we need to find the theta values from this and the condition they given it is purely imaginary when it is purely imaginary is then real is equals to real part is equals to zero so if they mention purely imaginary remains real part is equals to zero suppose they mention purely real means imaginary part is equals to zero so we simplify this given how we simplify here denominator having imaginary that is complex number so we can rationalize the denominator that is divided by 1 minus 2i sin theta rationalize this denominator 1 plus 2i sin theta divided by 1 plus 2i sin theta here i rationalized now simplify this first you multiply the numerator 3 into 1 that is 3 plus 3 into 2 6 i sin theta then plus 3 with 3 the simplification over now with the next term 2i sin theta 2i sin theta into 1 that is 2i sin theta plus here the next one 2i sin theta with the 2i sin theta 2 2 is a 4 plus 4 i into i i square sin theta into sin theta sin square theta so next whole divided by denominator it's looking like a minus b into a plus b what is the formula a square minus b square now use this formula in the denominator a is 1 b is 2i sin theta so a square that is 1 square minus b square what is b square 2i sin theta whole square now here add real terms 3 i square means how much minus 1 i square value is minus 1 4 into minus 1 that is minus 4 sin square theta and here 6 i sin theta plus 2 i sin theta 6 plus 2 8 i sin theta divided by 1 square is 1 and 2 square is 4 and i square is minus 1 minus minus plus 4 into 1 4 sin square theta so in this separate the real part and imaginary part the real part is is equals to 3 minus 4 sin square theta divided by denominator 1 plus 4 sin square theta it is real part the remaining is imaginary part it 
when it is having i then we call it as imaginary so it is imaginary no need to take why because they mentioned here it is purely imaginary then what is the condition real part is equals to zero so real part is how much zero 3 minus 4 sin square theta divided by 1 plus 4 sin square theta so now do cross multiplication 0 into 1 plus 4 sin square theta that is 0 is equals to 3 minus 4 sin square theta so from this send 3 to this side it will become minus 3 is equals to minus 4 sin square theta minus minus cancel then sin square theta is equals to 3 divided by 4 from this sin theta is equals to what is the sin theta plus or minus square root of 3 by 2 now we write the values when we get root 3 by 2 at 60 degrees we will get positive sin at sin 60 degrees we get uh, root 3 by 2 and at minus 60 degrees we get minus root 3 by 2 and they given uh, the interval open interval the open interval is minus pi by 2 comma pi so theta in the range of my in between of minus pi by 2 to pi means uh, if i take 120 at 120 also we will get the value suppose um, at 120 degrees the values we get so now we write the values are theta belongs to minus pi by 2 comma minus 60 that is minus pi by 3 comma and one more is plus 60 that is pi by 3 comma next 120 degrees 120 degrees means 2 pi by 3 in the question they are asking sum of elements in a so the elements in this interval are after 2 pi by, by 3 after this 2 pi by 3 the last element is pi so we consider only this elements to add at these values it satisfies this value now we add these three elements so sum is equals to minus pi by 3 plus pi by 3 plus 2 pi by 3 so cancel plus minus then answer is 2 pi by 3 check the options so option d is correct 2 pi by 3